Other news today, he definitely does not fit your typical profile of a tagger, but today, after daring appearances on YouTube, a college-educated graphic artist is arrested, accused of being one of Los Angeles' most prolific taggers. KCAL 9's Mark Coogan live now in Hollywood with more. Mark? Mia, behind me is the Western Avenue Bridge over the Hollywood Freeway. It's been defaced by taggers, but according to the L.A. County Sheriff's Department, for one notorious tagger and a pioneer at those locations, it proved to be one bridge too many. Watch this, a graffiti vandal with the tag, Bucket Wanted You To. He had someone videotape him as he climbed over the railing of the Western Avenue Bridge over the Hollywood Freeway. Then he inched out onto the narrow lip of a steel beam beneath the bridge deck, and spray can in hand, Bucket tagged the bridge in broad daylight as cars whizzed by 20 feet below. It's me, EV, evidence, dialing the with my people saying we're on war for but yesterday, Bucket, a.k.a. Cyrus Yazdani, a 24-year-old college graduate with a degree in art, was arrested by L.A. County Sheriff's deputies and booked on felony vandalism charges. The Sheriff's Department claimed Yazdani was responsible for as much as $300,000 in damage statewide, figuring the cleanup cost. It called Yazdani one of the most prolific taggers or bombers in the L.A. area and one of the most brazen. This daytime defacing of an MTA bus in downtown Los Angeles was what brought Yazdani to deputies' attention after it was posted on YouTube. The videos, splashed across the Internet, brought Yazdani fame in tagging circles, notoriety elsewhere, and yesterday, a jail cell. Cyrus Yazdani's been booked on a $100,000 bail. He was arrested at a probation office. He was already on probation for a 2007 tagging conviction. And in perhaps the ultimate insult, his tag here on the bridge already has been defaced by other graffiti vandals. Live in Hollywood, Mark Coogan, KKL 9 News, back to you. All right.